than getting the job done against the spread on the road. And with that said, welcome to the show. Got some lines and personal leans out for college football week four. Wow, can't believe it's week four already. But before we get into some more of that, I just want to remind you to check out my daily best play at patreon.com slash Brock Page. And with a documented win percentage of 60% for the entire year of 2017, you're costing yourself valuable information each and every day you're not subscribed. Packages begin at just $1.99 a month. There's also plenty of free content there as well. So once again, please feel free to hit that pause button right now. Open up your browser and just quickly check me out at patreon.com slash Brock Page. It'll only take you a few seconds. Link is in the description section below. And if you're a current patron of mine and you're watching this program right now, I just can't thank you enough. You make it all worth it. And without any further uh, further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at our week four slate of college football lines and personal leans. All starts Eastern Standard Time. And up next, it is going to be Georgia at Missouri. 12 o'clock kickoff. The Bulldogs of Georgia are the 14-point favorites in this matchup here. We're seeing some early money come pouring in on the Bulldogs to cover the number already. It'll be a warm day in Missouri. 76 by kickoff, 8-mile-an-hour wind toward the eastern boundary. And if you like the Tigers to cover the double digits, you're in a pretty good spot here as I'm already seeing a couple shops already at 14.5 and and on their way to that number. So if these betting trends on Sue... You might even see this one get up to 15 and a half by the closing number. And if you like Georgia in this spot here, you're probably at your best number right now. Now, when it comes to the trends in this matchup, I really think they tend to favor the Bulldogs of Georgia. They're 3-0 straight up for the season, 2-1 ATS in those three ball games. They did have a quality win over South Carolina in a thorough drubbing of the Gamecocks. They're going up against a Missouri squad who's a little bit outclassed in almost every position on the field. And if you're into historical figures, the Tigers dropped five of their last six straight up to the Bulldogs. Now, total-wise, not sure where this one's going to open up at, but I have to imagine we may see a little over money come pouring in at some point. UJA's 5-2 and two to the over in their last seven on the road, 4-2 and two to the over in their last six against Mizzou. Meanwhile, on the Missouri uh, side of things, they've dropped 40 points on Purdue and Wyoming, respectively. So with all that said and done, I still can't make a play on the total since we have none, but I will be leaning toward the Bulldogs in this matchup here. Give me Georgia, minus 14, getting the job done against the spread. Next game, Tulane travels to Ohio State, 3.30 kickoff at Ohio Stadium. The 